Hey guys, it's Amy Deb, the Keto Queen. I had to stop a minute to go live with you guys one more time. I know earlier I went live and showed you a little piece of Washington. We're visiting Washington for the first time this week for a drug and alcohol conference for my full-time job with my family. But guys, I have to show you another beautiful reason that I think Washington is gorgeous. And I cannot wait to bring my husband back here because there's just so many beautiful things to see. If you're jumping on, let me know where you're watching from and if you've ever visited Washington. Now, it's not so pretty behind me. Oh, you see those cones? You see garbage? Well, let me show you what's in front of me. Guys, get ready. Open your eyes wide. It is gorgeous, and here it is. Is that not beautiful? This is Snoqualmie, Snoqualmie Falls. Guys, it is literally right off the road. You park into this beautiful little park and you literally walk, not even, how many yards would you say this is, Lana? I mean, I would say less than 500 yards. It is like the easiest walk to this most beautiful Snoqualmie Falls. I mean, it's just beautiful. Let me show you this, uh, this sign here. So that's what Snoqualmie Falls. And I mean, this is so cool. It is so cool. Now it really is an electric, uh, it's some kind of electric piece of this town. But I mean, they made a beautiful waterfall out of it. So I have to tell you, you need to come visit Washington. I'm like the spokesperson for Washington right now, even though I live in Tennessee, because I've seen so many beautiful things. I posted earlier today a waterfall that we saw at Mount Rainier. Rainier, Rainier, I don't know how you say it. I need to find out how to pronounce the mountain. That's awful. It's Mount Rainier National Park is what I'm saying. But this guy's was like literally less than 400. I'm gonna say less than five, for sure less than 500 yards of a walk to this beautiful i mean look how beautiful this is guys have you ever visited washington that's the question and if you haven't would you want to after i've showed you some of the pictures from this week's adventure so we have another quick break from our conference and this was 30 miles not 30 miles it was 30 minutes 30 minutes from our conference and we decided we'd run over here for 30 minutes just to see this because someone at the conference said it was really quick you could get to it really quick and then we could get back to conference <laughs> So that's what we did. We ran from our conference uh, class to see this beautiful site and we're fixing to run back. But I want to show you the beautiful trees too. It's just a beautiful state. And look how pretty this is. It's so colorful. It's so lush. Everything we've seen is just beautiful. So anyhow, I had to show you this. Now, like I said, it's a, it's inside like a, an electric place. Let me find this. Uh, it's a hydroelectric project is what this says. So it's a hydroelectric project. That's why this is here in this small town of Sequamee. But when you walk to it, this is like this little walkway and it goes up into this beautiful little park. And I will definitely take some pictures of this cute little park because it's just beautiful. I tried to call my husband so I could show him and he didn't answer. So I thought, what's the next best thing to do? FaceTime my friends. I want you guys to see this. It's just so gorgeous. <laughs> so just so you know, you, you ring high way up on the list with my husband as and to share amazing beautiful things so i hope you guys know that oh wow there's people way down there there's people way down there you must be able to hike down there you might you must be able to, to hike down there. there's a little trail anyhow guys i don't want to take your time i just want to say hello and if you're new to my page you'll always find some adventure from me and my family or my friends you'll definitely find great foods You'll definitely have encouragement and inspiration. If you're new to my page, I hope that you have found those things already. And if you are brand new to keto or low carb, I would love to help you with some getting started tips. So put getting started in the comments and then just be ready for some fun and some laughs and some family time on the Keto Queen page because that's what I do. I love to have fun. I love to travel with my family. We work hard and we love to inspire other people. So guys, you have an awesome night and I will see you all later. Bye.